please share and subscribe. This Lenovo laptop doesn't turn on. Power switch turns on, but then monitor stays dark. We check the monitor connected to the television. It doesn't work. We check the hard drive. It doesn't work. Hard drive is fine. Monitor is fine. The RAMs are good. So it's the motherboard that's faulty. We'll show you how to open it and how to replace the motherboard. Tools needed. Two Phillips set. Small Phillips set screwdrivers. Easy procedure. To open it, flip it over. Take the battery out. And open the screws. There are screws here. All the screws. Open all these screws. Open here. Check if the RAMs over here work and make sure you do not. Take the hard drive out. Stupid drum out. When you take this screw out, the, re the tray will come out. Enter tray. Not easy. We took the screws off. A few screws, take those off. These screws off and three screws here as well as all the other screws and flip it over pry it off here slowly all around and watch out for the clips so that open these bands, these connectors, but you have to these are the ones, these are the ones connected to these. You have to flip this little little black tab. You flip it up and then then pull it up, pull it out from here will come out. Don't pull it without flipping this little back black tab. It's crying. This thing goes up and down. Ready. Take off these screws. Make sure you disconnect this cable and then you pull the mother out, motherboard out. Connect this same method. Flip it up. Flip it up. 
있어. Disconnect this terminal. This one. Get the board over. And and this one. Then the mother board come up. Can you take the mother board out? the old one this is the new motherboard brand new take the processor out out and the cooling fan of the old motherboard install it here the new motherboard separated the <coughs> Like this, choose new paste, take it out nicely, put it in here without damaging any pins. Holy pride of himself. As you replace the RAMs, make sure it fully goes into the slot. Watch carefully how far in the pins are. All the way in. This is the bottom one. If it's not fully in, it will not work. These clips on the side should lock as soon as the RAM goes in all the way. Let's change this chip, put it from the old one, take it out of here. in here make sure it goes in nicely so installation is basically the reverse of what you did to take it off start with this uh, corner this at the bottom there's a connector there's the first one goes from the bottom and this this terminals one so one at a time carefully connect this black and this white cable right up under here don't forget monitor wouldn't work without it screw it Put the screws back, they're all connected. This one. Make sure the Wi-Fi switch 
right here, right here. It's properly installed in there. Put the keyboard back on. There's there's six connectors. One, two, three, four. Five, six. Connect them properly. So all the cables are in. Mm -hmm. Time to put it back. So this is how you replace the motherboard and hopefully the computer will turn on. Plug the power adapter in and turn on the computer.